So for this problem, uh, we'll be using equation 18.9 and uh, equation 12.25. Uh, <clears throat> now, we'll be taking the absolute values first and then uh, we'll go on from there. So from equation 18.9, the if we just take the absolute values, we have absolute value of delta L which is equal to L times alpha times absolute value of delta T. And similarly, 12.25 will give us absolute value of F over A or force per unit area, which is equal to E times delta L over L. Now, the ultimate strength of the steel is, let's say, F by A and we call it rupture that means uh, above that uh, the steel will break and uh, let's denote a notation SU for that which is 400 times 10 to the power 6 Newton per meter squared and we get that from table 12.1. Now, if we combine the above equations uh, by eliminating delta L over L, we see that alpha times delta T is absolute value of delta T is equal to one over E times F by A absolute value. I hope that got correct. Uh, yeah, and then we can write that as SU divided by E times alpha, which is 400 times 10 to the power 6 Newton per meter squared divided by E, which is 200 times 10 to the power 9 Newton per meter squared. And alpha is 11 times 10 to the power minus 6 per degree Celsius. And this uh, calculation gives us the, temp the change in, mm, OK, uh, there is a mistake here. So when we're uh, using SU by E alpha, we take this alpha on the right. So this is E times alpha. Right. And uh, when we do the calculation, we see that the temperature is 182 degrees Celsius. So that's the change in temperature. Now, since we're dealing with the temperature decrease, so that means uh, we have to take negative 182 as our temperature. Uh, uh, we have to take uh, the negative part of 182 so that the de there's a temperature decrease. So that means the temperature at, we, at which that rod will rupture is 25 degrees Celsius. That's the initial temperature. Then we subtract 182 from there. So that will give us negative 157 degrees Celsius. So at negative 157 degrees Celsius temperature, the rod will rupture. All right. Thanks for listening. I'll see you next.